The, the team played maybe on day one. Got to be happy with the improvement throughout the weekend. Well, certainly. I mean, you know, it's a tough way to lose the finals, uh, that's for sure. But, um, you know, Surabi's so got a lot of talent out there. And, and, you know, that was kind of our game plan to hang on to the ball the majority of the game. And, and we did that and just kind of <laughs> inches short multiple times. But that's that's rugby, you know. Sometimes that happens. Sometimes you get through. Sometimes you don't. So On both sides of the ball, it seemed like the defensive intensity was pretty high. And the, the players were making some good tackles. Is that something that you you've been focusing on throughout the weekend? Well, yeah, I mean, just the, you know, to have each other's back, essentially. I mean, we, we gave up a, a line breaker that got behind us. Uh, all seven of the guys worked worked to cover each other, and, and you know, that was the focus uh, defensively, and, and really happy with that defensive effort. To hold a team like that with that many, uh, you know, try scores on the field to, to two tries is, is, is a good effort. So the goal of the Falcons is obviously to create an atmosphere where they're pushing for places in the first team. Right. Do you think there were players this weekend that kind of made a statement that they want one of those spots in Wellington? Uh, I think certainly, uh, you know, probably seven, eight of them. Are, I mean, they're all dying to get in there, you know. That's what they're working their tails off for. So, uh, you know, it was good to good for them to get out here and get a run against uh, some good competition and, you know, prove that they belong. And, you know, we'll probably see some of them out there sooner rather than later. You never know.